हेलो स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास वन वेलकम टू द मैथ्स क्लास सो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल लर्न फॉर्मिंग टू डिजिट नंबर्स यूजिंग द गिवन डिजिट्स ओके सो वी विल अंडरस्टैंड विद द हेल्प ऑफ टू केसेस फर्स्ट केस इज विदाउट रिपीटिंग द डिजिट्स एंड द सेकंड केस इज विथ द डिजिट्स रिपीटिंग फर्स्ट वन इज विदाउट repeating and next case is with repeating okay so focus on the word first we will start with case 1 that is without repeating the digits so see number 1 what you have to do two digits are given 1 and 2 so you have to form two digit numbers with these two digits okay 1 and 2 you have to form two digit numbers okay so form form the numbers with the help of 1 and 2 first number will be 1 2 12 okay second number will be 2 1 21 so any other number can you make no only we can make two digit two numbers 12 and 21 from 1 and 2 okay now number 2 5 and 6 so we have to form two digit numbers 5 6 56 and the other number is 6 5 65 okay understood Number three, three digits are there, three, four, and five. So how many digits can you make? Uh, first, start with three and four. Thirty-four. Suppose we will take three and four first, and forget about five. Okay, only three and four is there. So only for three and four are there. So we will make. numbers with the help of 3 and 4 what is the first number 3 4 34 and what is the second number 4 3 43 okay so write 4 3 43 now cover 3 now make numbers with 4 and 5 4 5 45 then reverse Five four fifty four. Okay, then we will cover four, and we will make numbers with the digit three and five. Okay, three five thirty five, and the last number is five three fifty three. Clear? Okay. Now number four, seven, eight, and nine. Three digits are there, so we have to make two digit numbers with the help of these three digits. Okay. First of all, we will take these two numbers and we will cover nine. Okay. We will cover nine and make numbers with seven and eight. Seven, eight, seventy-eight. Then reverse backward eight seven eighty seven. Okay, now cover seven eight nine eighty nine. Then reverse nine eight ninety eight. Okay, then cover eight. Then make seven nine seventy nine. Reverse. Nine seven ninety seven. So one two three four five six. We got six numbers. Okay. See this one number five zero one and two. Remember tens and ones. In the previous class we did counting of tens and ones. So if we write zero in tens place. And one in 
one's place. Okay. So what you can see, you will get only number one, only digit one, because zero has no value. Okay. If we write, if we write zero again in tens place and write two, then you will get only one number, only one digit. That is two. Zero one equal to one. Zero two equal to two. Because if we write zero in tens place and and only one digit is there. After this, I mean one. Uh, if we write one or two in ones place, then zero has no value. So we will write only the number that is written in the ones place. Okay. One and two, understood? Now we will make words with zero, one, and sorry, we will make numbers with zero, one, and two. Okay. So first cover two, and you have zero and one. So we can make one zero ten. Okay. Then we will cover zero. We are getting one and two. Then make word make numbers with one and two. One two twelve two one twenty one. Okay. Now cover one. What you are getting? Two zero twenty. We will not write zero one zero two because if we are writing zero in tens place, it has no value. We are getting only one number. But here. We have to make two digit number. This is only one digit number. This is the digit one digit number. Okay, so we will not write zero one and zero two. This is your answer. Understood? Now number six, zero three and four. Okay, so we have to cover four first. Then we are getting three zero thirty. Then we will cover zero. Then we are getting. Three four thirty four, reverse four three forty three. Okay, now we will cover three. What we are getting four zero forty. Understood? See the board properly. Understood? Now see your book. Page number thirty four. Page number thirty four. Exercise question number one. Form two digits numbers using the digits given below. Okay, you have to do this at home. Question number one and question number two. Find the greatest and the smallest number formed by the digits. So you have to form numbers with the help of these digits, and you have to see which number is the greatest. And which number is the smallest? And you have to write greatest number and the smallest number. Okay, understood? Question number one and two. This is your homework, thirty-four page and exercise question number one and two. Understood? So students, have a nice day, all of you.